All right, everyone, this is the uh, SFT100 stereo uh, R&D player that I got from John Stevens at the workshop. Um, they added a, a stereo light right here, and then it has the, uh, the 400 stereo board in the bottom. Um, I believe it normally came with a 300 board, as indicated on the uh, label on the cover. And so, yeah, let's uh, give you a little demonstration here of how it works. Uh, we want to throw it into the load position. Uh, I'm going to give a, a shout out to uh, Lloyd Raynham, who purchased this disc in December of 1983. Stereo. That's the, uh, it's actually a variation of this disc. Um, one will have the uh, stereo like that, and then the other one will have it in red letters. And uh, one of them actually has some time cut out from the movie. I don't remember offhand which one, but it's on the uh, it's on the uh, forum that I created about the uh, variations. But um, all right, let's throw it into play here. Now, the first time I tried to play this, uh, the wheel actually wasn't spinning. See, he's got the uh, the line on there. Got the line drawn on. It does appear to be going now. But um, as you can see, we have a stereo disc. The stereo light is lit up, and they actually made a uh, a cutaway in the case. There, you can see the little cutaway. They kind of scraped the paint off of the uh, front cover, where the stereo light will shine through. Did you hear that? That was stereo sound. Through my tiny little prison TV. But um, this is a fully serviced player by John Stevens. Everything works great. And if we want to make sure we're getting both channels, let's... Unplug the right channel. We still have sound. Plug the right channel back in, unplug the left channel. And we still have sound. So it is... It is stereo through both channels. Well, not really. I mean, I haven't found Miss Wright yet, but when I do, the whole world... Or not through both channels, but you know what I mean. It's, both channels are working. Anyways. I don't know why it jumped to eight minutes in. I had it playing at eight minutes in before, so maybe it just kind of remembered that part. Looks amazing on this little TV. But that is the demonstration of my research and development stereo model SFT100. I'm going to go ahead and throw the cover back on this. Thanks for watching.